what's up everybody welcome back to another video so today we're here to do week eight week eight nfl picks man i cannot believe it's ready week eight here um but yeah let's go ahead and go through my picks so let's go ahead and get it over with so jaguars and steelers i'm gonna go with the jaguars here um jaguars they've been playing pretty well um lately um steelers um they're, they're a solid team. Steelers are always in the hunt, man. They're always going to be in it with Mike Tomlin. But I, I feel like the Jaguars are going to win this. Um, but, yeah, hopefully it should, be, it should be a pretty decent game, I feel like. Patriots and Dolphins. I'm going to Dolphins. Dolphins obviously took a, a tough loss last week to the Eagles. You know, that was a pretty decent good game. Um, this proves that Philadelphia is just the more better team. But I think they're going to beat New England. I know New England beat Buffalo next week or last week. I couldn't believe they beat Buffalo, but... New England, they're a solid team. Um, they're two and five though, so I, I mean I don't really think they're gonna go anywhere this year, but I'm gonna go with the Dolphins here. <laughs> this game right here, Chiefs and Broncos, man. Ah We played the Chiefs like two times in the past three weeks. <sighs> it fucking pains me to do it, but I'm going with the Chiefs, man. I am so sick of losing to this team. They won 16 straight games against the Broncos. We have not beat them since 20 freaking 15, man. I was in like fucking sixth grade last time we fucking beat them, bro. It's it's, it's pathetic. I want to I, I wanna beat the Chiefs because I'm sick of this fucking losing streak against them. But, man, they're going to beat us. I, even, if we play, even if the Chiefs play like shit, they're still going to beat us, man. Because every time we play the Chiefs, man... It's always one side of the ball. The defense don't show up. The offense don't show up. I mean, last time it was the offense didn't show up. The Chiefs are going to go out there and, like, do a lot of fucking dumbass plays. I guarantee it. Like, like, come on, man. For the Chiefs, they're not going to take the Broncos seriously. Like, they didn't take the Broncos seriously last game either. They literally did not take the Broncos seriously at all. I mean, they were doing fucking fake field goals, fake fucking shit. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? It's like the it's like the Chiefs are having a practice out there against the Broncos. It's pathetic. It's pathetic to even say that, but it's come to this point where the Chiefs are not even taking the Broncos seriously. They're going out there just fucking around, man, and they're still beating us. So I want to win. I want to win this game, but I don't fucking see it, man. I don't see it. Thursday night football: Buccaneers and the freaking Bills. I'm going with the Bills. Bills got to bounce back, man. They're kind of a fraud team right now. They're not looking. They're they're still a pretty decent team, but man, they're not looking good right now. They're losing to teams they should be beating. Like they should have beat New England. No excuse about that. Um, you got C.J. Stroud and Bryce Young here. Texans and Panthers. I'm going to Texans. The Texans are a pretty damn good team. They're a pretty decent team, man. The Texans have a really bright future ahead of them, man. And Carolina, they just continue to be the only winless team in the league. New York here. You got. Jets and Giants, I'm going with the Jets. And the only reason I'm going with them is because that defense, because I feel like they're going to go after, I think Daniel Jones coming back, and I do not trust Daniel Jones one bit, man. He sucks. Daniel Jones is garbage. The Giants O-line sucks. I think the Jets D-line is going to have a, a freaking fest against them, man. They're going to fucking eat that O-line alive, man. I'm going with the Jets here. Saints and the Colts, I'm going with the Colts. Um, New Orleans, they're just, I don't think they're that good of a team. Especially their offense is fucking is not fucking good at all, man. Their offense, Derek Carr, uh, he's just mid, man. He's so mid. I have him in fantasy. Right now he's my quarterback three, but he may I might have to start him this week because Brock Purdy might be in freaking concussion protocol. So I might have to fucking start Derek Carr, man. It sucks, but uh, so stupid. But yeah, I'm going with the Colts, man. And I guess this is kind of my upset of the week. I got Tennessee being Atlanta. I know I think they're favored by two. The Falcons are favored by two, I think. All I know is they're favorites. So I'm going to go with the Titans here and at home. I think, I think Ryan Tannehill is questionable. I think he might not play, but they're going to start on Will Levis or the other quarterback to have um, Malik Willis or Will Levis. One of the, one of the quarterbacks are going to start for them. I think they're going to get the win. I don't think I don't think Atlanta's that very good. Their offense is not very good. Desmond Ritter is fucking garbage. The only reason they won last week was because their defense saved them. But other than that, man, like this the freaking Falcons offense sucks. Like Desmond Ritter is so bad, man. He's so bad. I at this point, I would start fucking Tyler Henneke, man. I would start Taylor Henneke at this point over fucking Desmond Ritter. Um Browns and Seahawks. I'm going with the Seahawks. Um Browns got some injuries. I think Deshaun Watson's coming back, though, but should be a decent game. I'm going with the Seahawks, though, at home. Browns got to travel all the way to Seattle. 
I think the Seahawks are going to win that game. Ravens and Ravens and Cardinals, man, the Ravens are going to win. Ravens kind of shocked me last week. They beat the shit out of the Lions. I was not expecting that to happen at all. I mean, they just beat the shit out of the Lions. I was like, whoa, I was shocked. Um, Bengals and 49ers. This should be a good game. I'm going to go with the 49ers. I know Brock Purdy's in concussion protocol, maybe. <sighs> he, Sam Darnold may start. <laughs> But they have enough playmakers, I think, to win this game. I mean, I won't be surprised if Bengals win, to be honest with you. But I'm going with the Niners here at home. Plus, they lost last week, too, to the Vikings. I cannot believe that either. It's Kirk Cousins, my guy. Shout out to Kirk Cousins, man. People want to hate on Kirk Cousins. He fucking beat the Niners, man. Oh, my God. Why is this Sunday night football, man? Why is this Sunday night football, bro? Why? <laughs> Bears and Chargers. Go with the Chargers, man. But if the Bears win this, <laughs> I'm gonna laugh at the Chargers, man. They beat the, I mean, they beat the Raiders last week. But man, why is this Sunday night football, man? Why is this Sunday night football, man? These games are fucking bad. And this is Monday night football. You got the Raiders and Lions. I'm going with the Lions, man. The Lions are gonna win this game with ease, I think. Raiders are a mess, man. They're talking about trading people away. Ah, <sighs> oh, man. The, Ra the Raiders are a mess. Josh McDaniels is a fucking idiot. He needs to get it fired. He sucks, man. I'm going to the Lions. But, man, some of these primetime matchup mans are just fucking bad. <sighs> they need to start flexing some games because these primetime games are fucking terrible. Eagles and Washington. I'm going to go with the Eagles. Um, Vikings and Packers. The Packers are fucking terrible. How did they lose to the Broncos, man? Packers are really bad. Jordan Love's not the answer. He's fucking terrible, bro. I'm going to the Vikings. The Vikings are going to bounce back, get back in the wild card hunt. I think Minnesota can go on a run, man. I think Minnesota can go on a decent run here coming up with their schedule coming up. And you got the Rams and Cowboys. I'm going to go with the Cowboys. But, yeah, there is my week eight predictions. Comment down below your picks down below. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel, guys. I appreciate all the support lately on the channel. We're trying to get the 2,000 subscribers here hopefully soon. So if you guys are new watching this video, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel. Comment down below your predictions for week eight. And hope you guys have a good night and peace. See you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.